Hey guys, I'm Rasim from RossmerTech.com, and in this tutorial, I'm going to talk about numbers. So, what are numbers? Well, there are two flavors of numbers. There is the INT, integers of arbitrary size, which are basically any number without a decimal point. Then we have the double, which are 64 bit double precision floating point numbers, any number with a decimal point. For the integers, INT, I gave an example of a 5. And uh, with double, I gave an example of a 5.5. So integers are we use to initialize a variable that uh, with a number value. So let's say if we wanted to uh, initialize two variables i and t, let th those two variables uh, have a, let's say a, a number value of five, and then uh, later on add those two uh, variables up to get an answer. Same thing with the double. I'm going to give you guys an example of that right now. So I'm going to open up my Dart editor here and. Uh, as you can see, I used the INT to initialize a variable, which I called test1, and I gave a value of 5. I also did the same thing with a variable called test2, and I gave that variable, sorry about that, and I also gave that variable a value of 5. Then I initialized another variable I called answer. I didn't give a value. So underneath here, I used answer, I used this code answer, space, equals, space, the test one, the integer I initialized up here, space plus test two, the second uh, integer I initialized up here. So basically test one sh should equal five, test two should equal five. And I had uh, these two should be equal equal to 10 when you add them up. And this uh, code here, print uh, parentheses answer, it's gonna print the value of answer, which should be, the, which should be five plus five. So we're going to test it out right now. There you go. 5 plus 5 equals 10. That's correct. Now I'm going to show you guys double. So I'm going to replace INT with double. Sorry about that. Now, I'm going to give it a decimal point. I'll, I'll give it a 5.5 instead of a 5. Since uh, doubles have to be uh, numbers with a decimal point. Now, I'm just going to run this program. And it works. So, 5.5 5 plus 5.5 equals 11. So, so the, the answer is correct. Now, that's pretty much it. I'm going to leave a uh, sample of this code on my description. If you guys enjoyed this video and if it was helpful, please subscribe to my channel. If you have any comments, leave me comments. I'm Rasim from RossMertech.com and thanks for watching.